hear about that? Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. good evening. And thank you for inviting me to be a part of this opening celebration. <coughs> I read that when uh, Prime Minister Trudeau of Canada uh, visited Washington last year, he presented 150 maple trees to the United States. <laughs> and nice try. <laughs> Uh, the cherry trees have a hundred year head start over those maples, you know. <laughs> Besides, you know, which uh, would you rather be? A cherry blossom princess or a maple sap princess? <laughs> Not even close, you know. Uh, I hope there is no Canadian audience. But anyway, uh, the Washington people of Washington uh, have taken the cherry trees into their heart and wholeheartedly welcome Japan's gift of all those years ago. And today, the National Cherry Blossom Festival is the biggest, I say, the biggest celebration of Japan-U.S friendship in the United States. I'm proud. Actually, this is my fifth spring in DC. People might be thinking, where, when I'm leaving? <laughs> but I'm not leaving yet. <laughs> That's good, Master. And if you think I'm getting homesick for Japan, you would be wrong. <laughs> because you know every spring, uh, the, this National Cherry Blossom Festival brings Japan to Washington, D.C. And a few years ago, I wrote a haiku poem about the traffic congestion that the cherry blossom <laughs> Some of you might remember. <laughs> you know, uh, after that, I received so many comments that I decided to write one this year about the cherry blossoms damaged by the ice and the frigid uh, temperatures and so forth. So I tried and actually wrote on that line. But my wife told me my heart poems are too literal and prosaic. <laughs> but here goes. This is, a, uh, this is a pretty good one, possibly improvement. <laughs> here you go, you listen. Eaglet, you know eaglet, right? Eaglet hatched in snow. Blossomed which stood winter's chill. Two nations reverse. Aww. What do you think? I could be a professional haiku writer. <laughs> After I leave this job, I would do it. <laughs> but anyway, Diana and the staff and volunteers of the festival have all kinds of wonderful things planned, uh, starting with tonight. A lot of Japanese businesses are supporting the festival, particularly DNA. <coughs> Japanese companies all over the country give back to their communities, not just by providing jobs, by sharing Japan's culture and spirit. And I thank them. This is the 90th anniversary of the first Cherry Blossom Festival, 
and I know it is going to be the best year. Thank you all and welcome to spring.